Hey what is up guys Johnny here in today's video we look at a new sniper rifle that was just added in the most recent update in Shadowgun Legends is the Airy Special Sniper Rifle. It is looking really good aesthetically I mean it is probably the best looking epic sniper in the game it doesn't have a crazy skin like the legendary snipers like the OG moneymaker for example is very flashy and the true patriot with all the stars and stripe but this thing right here the bright orange colors the scope is looking super clear i really like this sniper rifle but we have to look at the stats all right so this is the airy special look at the stats real quick but it doesn't mean much it's just a bunch of number 1057.8 uh 50 as the fire rate 2.5 the accuracy 30 is the range and the eight in the clip i really like this right now eight in the clip is uh one of the highest in sniper rifles true patriots got six the besson's got seven so eight is very nice one thing you have to know though is this airy special i dropped it in the hive mind dungeon and it dropped at 248 power so i know you can find it in the shop at 249 we'll look at that in a couple of seconds so just a bunch of numbers like that it doesn't mean much if you don't compare it to another rifle that you like if you're gonna compare this epic sniper rifle i like to compare it with other epic snipers and the best epic sniper right now you know is the besson's killer so let's check the besson stats and compare it with the airy special so i just equipped my besson it's now 249 since the update so 1062 the damage used to be 1066 at 250 uh still you see seven in the clip and all that stuff 27 the range it's just three meters less doesn't make a difference in the game right now the snipers usually i kind of ignore the range when i look at the stats so if you put them side by side you'll see the red numbers mean the airy special got less than the besson because i got my besson equipped right now so 1057 the damage is red so that means if you just look real quick the besson deals more damage and it has a higher fire rate so that's gonna be a very short video right why would you go with an airy special if it's got less damage and less fire rate what are you gaining by using that uh one bullet in the clip and that's kind of it right now let's go in the shop and check that airy special at 249 so it just happened that willow has a airy special on sale right now for 500 gold it's about five dollars and it is 249 and look at the damage now because i'm equipped uh with my best in right now 1062.1 is the exact same damage uh, of the Besson. So this is pretty crazy, right? The same damage, a bit less on the fire rate, and everything else is better. The Eerie can actually compete with the Besson. And the fact that it's got one more bullet, uh, you have to think twice about it. Well, think twice for real, because you know when you want a good weapon, you have to check at the perks. The perks matter. And that is where the biggest difference will be. The Eerie special comes with... 11% pickup radius, 9% damage, some accuracy, an extra 5%, and 4% iron sight damage. But remember, the Besson had 10% extra damage, and on top of that, the Besson had a 15% extra crit damage. This right here is another sniper rifle that does not come with crit damage in the perks. I don't think that you will see more with different perks because usually these unique weapons that has custom paint job and stuff they come with a fixed set of perks and no matter how often you will find them they always have the same because of all that the best in skiller is still the best epic rifle in the game and i would suggest you do not spend five dollars on that one especially since you can drop it in the hive mind dungeon anyways right now before we end this video guys I'm really curious about what's going on right now because we had a new update. You know, Madfinger games, they always have their secrets. They don't want to tell us everything. They did warn us that our power was going to drop with the update. They did warn us that only the legendaries should have 250 power and your epic weapons would lose some of their power. I understand everything, but the one thing I don't understand is why is it that you drop this rifle in the dungeons at 248? so it does have a little bit less damage it's just like five points okay it doesn't make a huge difference it's just five points out of a thousand sixty something right so plus five minus five 
it's not gonna change anything and also when you play pvp uh what i understand is all your stuff is level one anyway so i'm thinking if you have the eerie special at 248 or 249 if you bring that thing in the pvp match it's gonna deal the exact same damage uh correct me if i'm wrong i want to know but this is what i understand so why exactly are they doing this they give you a weapon for free but they offer you the same weapon for real money but it's gonna have a little bit of an edge like not much just a little little something you know and i don't want to hear the pay to win argument in the comments please because it's still not pay to win okay guys it has nothing to do with pay to win I did talk about pay to win in the past. Pay to win is when you pay to beat other players that don't pay, okay? And we're talking players versus players. If you go PvP, I told you if you paid for it or if you found it in the dungeon, they will be the same at level 1. It's each level give them a little bit of damage. Everything else the same, right? So, I don't say pay to win, but I just don't totally understand why i mean you could pay for the weapon or you can find it for free it should be the same because it's gonna make a little difference in arena farming maybe in dungeon and overall damage output i i'm not a big fan of that i i hope it's a mistake i really hope it's just a, a bug or something so that will be it for now i really want to hear from you guys what do you think about all that and final word on the eerie special i really like it i think it's the most beautiful skin on an epic sniper it's just the stats it falls short a little bit compared to other weapons and even in the more common uh epic weapons because the besson is very rare but the at mendel and the other one ziska too they can come with crit and you will see them very often in the shop so I don't know i would go for uh, another one that's got just better stats and better perks so that's it for today guys if you enjoyed this video please leave a like subscribe to the channel turn on your notifications watch my other videos i'll be back soon take care